You can personalize the invoices and quotes you send your customers by choosing from a variety of templates and adding logos. You can also enter any terms and conditions you want to appear on your layouts and enter your default invoice numbering and quote options. Firstly, we'll start with the invoice templates. Click the Settings tab, then click Logo and Document Template. To change the template for your invoices and quotes, browse through the product and service invoice templates and select your preferred layout. If you have a company logo, you can add this to your template. If you want to add images to the bottom of your invoices, you can also add up to two association logos. Just click the Upload Image option and browse to the image file and click Open. We recommend you use an image size of 280 by 200 pixels or less. If you'd like, you can set a theme colour, the font and the size of the text on your invoices. Once you're happy with your changes, click Save. Next, we'll look at the settings. Click Invoice Form Settings. You can change the headings for the documents you generate. You can also amend your invoice numbering. For example, you might want your invoice numbering system to start from a particular number. Or you might want to change the prefix of your invoice numbers from the default setting of SI. You can also change the default prefix for sales credit notes and quick entries. Customise what details you'd like to show on your invoices and quotes, as well as how your columns are named. You can also add up to three columns of information on the bottom of your documents. For each invoice or quote you send, you might have a standard set of terms and conditions. You can enter these here so that they appear on your invoice by default. Enter any notes that you want to appear on your invoices, credit notes and quotes. This section could be used for bank details or useful information such as opening times. If you sell goods or services to VAT registered customers in the EU, although VAT is zero rated, you should inform your customers on their invoices of the VAT rate which would normally apply if you were to sell the item within the UK. You can do this using the EU sales descriptions area. This text automatically appears depending on the VAT rate you choose when you create the invoice. If required, you can amend the default text that appears on the invoice here. Once you have amended your invoice and quote settings and you are happy with this, click Save. You have now successfully entered your invoice and quote settings.